feel like I'm putting on a potato sack. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is RP Hoves and I do makeup and beauty videos. I do makeup and fashion videos. So for today's video, I am gonna be doing a Pretty Little Things haul. If you're not familiar with them, they always have these 50%, uh, 60%, 80% off sales that you just punch in the promo code and it knocks off a huge chunk of your um, shopping cart price. And I did some shopping about two weeks ago. Um, I had two things in mind when I was doing my shopping and it was for a bridal shower and a baby shower. So you were, I was thinking flowy, pastel, tight. I just had both in mind. And my previous shopping experience with them wasn't the best. Just the way they're close fit generally for me. I'm usually a small in tops and medium on bottoms, like 26, 27 in pants for a European sizing reference. And for tops, usually it's zero to four, depending on the cut, of course. But anyway, I ordered a couple of dresses, a couple of tops and one skirt, which I'm really excited for. Um, here's my package of things I'll be showing you and trying on. The first piece is going to be this dusty pink polka dot bardo tie waist shift dress. Which is super cute. It has the ruffly um, top. The waist is cinched in over here too so it gives you like that baby doll effect. And the bottom kind of cinches in here as well and it just fluffs out and then it has a little belt and belt loops. So this is how I styled this dress. I have it with a pair of Aquazura heels. Right over here they have little frilly details over there on the little straps and um, on the toe cap area. And the dress is really short but I think I can work with it. And you can even see how see-through it is if I zoom you in a bit. I feel really awkward filming over here, but it's a cute dress. Next up, I have this uh, mid-length lavender dress, which I am obsessed with the color. It fits pretty good. My one complaint is that it's so see-through, it looks like a bikini cover-up, and that makes me not want to try it on. But for the sake of this video, I'm gonna do it. And this feels super cheap. I don't want to be a negative Nancy, but this is how it looks. It looks cute up here. So you can literally see this, which isn't cute. Here is the second dress. As you can see, everything shows. You can see the line of my little spanky shorts. You can you can see everything. So this is one of the items that will be being returned. Okay, I'm back. I'm still wearing this dress. I just put the sleeves down so I can show you guys the next dress, which this one is the dusty lilac strappy mesh ruched mid maxi dress. Got this in a size four and I can't even get into it. I tried to try this on earlier and I literally could not get my body through this, which I don't understand why. This dress is the same size as everything else I've ordered. Maybe I'll try, but I, I just know it's not going to fit me. I feel like I'm putting on a potato sack. And I'm one of those people that don't put dresses up from here. I put my feet through it. Maybe if I put it over this way, it would be better, but I'm, I will literally get stuck in this. I put on another, another shirt so you guys can see because I'm about to zoom this in. So you guys don't feel like, oh my god. RP is lying to us right now. RP is not lying. RP is telling the whole truth. You guys see this? It's all. Go. <sighs> I'm breaking into a sweat trying to try this on. Girl, bye. Here is a dress that I haven't tried on yet, but it's another pink 
dress. Here we have was in the color scheme. When they put mesh, I didn't know they meant super see-through. And it doesn't smell that pleasant. Um, I'm just gonna try it on anyway. I mean, it's super soft. See, if I um, take my shirt off, you'll be exposed with everything here, which we don't want. So, um, it could have been cute, but I was played once again. This is a cowl neck, so if I didn't have this on, you could literally see everything here. Um, every little thing could fail. I have to do a comparison of reality versus online order of when you get your item in. Um, I went up a size in this because I thought it would be tight, but sis, being returned with the rest of your pieces now that we're done with trying on dresses i'm gonna show you guys the tops i bought i was catfished by the size So you could already imagine how see-through this one is. And I'm not going to bother trying it on because I literally broke into a sweat trying this one on. You can have the idea. Next three items I'm going to pair as an actual outfit because that was the idea I had in mind. But one of them I didn't like. So let's see how this looks. And also the skirt that I bought, I haven't tried it on yet. So let's see what I can do. Now that I finally have this body suit on, it's so cute. I think this is my favorite piece in the entire order that I have. Perhaps kind of feel cheapy, not the best quality, but I like how comfortable the actual bodysuit is itself, and it is double lined, so it's not see-through. Yes, thank God. It is a thong body, so obviously I'm not gonna show you guys that on camera, but I am wearing my high-waisted jeans that I bought in my previous Zara haul. Bought this, um, online it was displayed as a blazer jacket, and on the tag it says petite black tie waist jacket. It literally looked like a blazer, which is why I originally purchased it, so I could wear it with, um, just pants and pull off that blazer, um, the no top blazer look is that what it's called probably not but this looks like something my grandma would wear no shade no tea and it comes with a little black belt so you can put it around and just tie it but i'm returning this one because i don't it was literally a catfish for me so this is what it looks like oop bra peeping out it has a color it's not structured this is not it no so this one i'm not gonna be keeping either and um the skirt that i bought i will show you guys with this top fingers crossed that it fits um it's described as a fuchsia biker belted mini skirt and i bought it in a size six 
when I tell you guys they're sizing it off, no one listens to me. So here is the final outfit of my haul. This just popped out. It's okay, we're returning it anyway. It would have been so cute. But I'll stick to wearing this with the black pants or my black leather skirts that I have and call it a day. And I would wear strappy heels again because strappy heels are so cute. You can see everything. that's a wrap for this haul if you guys want to see more hauls subscribe like this video and comment down below what stores you want me to try next um i want to try Shein and i want to do a windsor and see where that takes me because i've been seeing some really cute stuff as of late so those will be my next hauls coming in the future and i am going to do some styling videos I've been saying this and I've been putting it off because I don't want to film it by myself because I want to make it cute and creative. So anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!